What's up YouTube, it's Vic. I'm back with another video and another flip and I'm about to show it to you right now. All right, we got a 2003 Honda Civic. Uh, not in bad shape. Paid 500 for it. Um, runs, drives, AC leaks. I'm gonna fix, try to fix the AC on it. Got some scuff marks here. Kind of dirty. The interior's all right. I'm about to drive it back to Daytona, about an hour away. So y'all wish me good luck. It's pretty clean on the inside. I just gotta clean it out mostly. Um, you ready? All right, we finna hit the road and do this thing. I hope we make it bike. There's traffic out here in Orlando on 50. It's fucking crazy, man. It's crazy out here. It's just traffic everywhere. I gotta get back to my side of the state. I got Wendy following me, man. We fixing to drive back. I'm gonna try to make this ride. I'm gonna have to put this camera down because I'm not, well, at least until we get out of all of this traffic, it ain't no AC. So when I get on the highway, it ain't gonna be no, it's gonna be a lot of noise. But I'm fixing to turn this camera off. I'm gonna let, I'm gonna get back with y'all when I get back to my house, to the apartment. We rolling. I'm back in Daytona and the cars, everything's been going pretty smooth with it. Roll pretty good on the highway. It's kind of shaky a little bit. When you get up to speed like 70, when you get up to speed like 70, it's a little shaky. But I mean, it's doable. But the only thing I'm, I have tend on doing with this car is cleaning it out. I'm gonna see how bad or where the AC is leaking from if it's not too if it's not too bad or too costly I'm gonna probably go on and fix the AC but if I put it up if I fix the AC I'm gonna put it up for like two two thousand the price for private seller on this car was twenty three hundred so I think if I fix the AC it's, it's got a few little dings in it I feel like if I fix the AC and how it drives I could get 2,000, between 1,800 and 2,000 is where I plan on landing with this one. But I also got another deal tomorrow. I'm gonna go check out in Oviedo. It's a 94, it's a 94 Toyota Corolla. And the AC works and everything. I really don't wanna go do it because I don't think it's gonna be, I don't think there's no value in it because of how old it is, but I mean, I hear people say Toyotas, Toyotas sell old or new, so I don't know. I'm gonna do some more research on it before I actually go tomorrow to go look at it. But I'm almost here back at the house. I'm, I'm gonna um, get back to the house and I'm gonna show y'all some more. All right, I made it back and it rolled pretty decent. I'm go over the little damage. It's got this little dent right here. I could get that out with a plunger that's an easy one um, as far as the dings it's got damage here it's got a lot it's got this around the edges I guess that's a common thing with these cars like somebody hit something here that's coming off that's all broke off I can probably get another one of them at the junkyard I saw it. I'm gonna probably do I'm gonna get a few of these parts at the junkyard not sure if i want to keep those i'm gonna see what they clean up like those little hub caps hood kind of rough looking we had a few things here something got hit this whole bumper is kind of loose i've dealt with that before already I'm trying to get that one of them bumpers fixed i mean but it ain't a bad car man interior is a little rough 
tire has got some meat on it. LX 2004. It ain't got a lot of... It mainly just need to be cleaned, man. It mainly need to just be cleaned. I'm going to put that breather box on in the morning. Clean it all out. Probably make another video about that. Cleaning it all out and stuff. But I just wanted to kind of go over with you guys the the purchase of it. Um, the girl kind of got us on it, in my opinion. She got us on it. She went for, um, she put in the ad a picture of another vehicle. It was an hour and some change away from us. So we drove out to Orlando. We're going to take a look at it. And we, as soon as, we, soon as I got there, I noticed that it wasn't the same car that she sent me but i went on and checked it out anyway she was pretty much open to us about like what all was wrong with it she showed it she let me drive it i drove it a little bit a little distance um before i purchased it and then i came home and um when we came back i um uh, i drove it all the way back from um orlando so i mean it made it pretty decent but i don't know i get these things right here and this was kind of a, it wasn't really a wild guess because I mean, I, I, I could see what damage it has. I could see the damage that it has pretty much that could get it to where I need, where I want the car to be at. See, you got all this stuff here, that damage. Um, everything as far as the, everything as far as the um, way that the car starts and all of that stuff and everything was pretty much a doozy I know it and when I stopped at the gas station and went to go start it back it's, I think I think that long start I think that long start has something to do with the um, air breather not being on there not sure I know the check engine light is on um, but with the check engine light being on I'm, I'm gonna check it out. I'm gonna put my computer on it in the morning. I just got back. It's kind of late and I got some things I got to do I got to finish editing some videos. So I'm not gonna really mess with this thing until in the morning but um Yeah, the, the I Mean it starts right up The Buick LeSabre the Buick LeSabre actually sold today for 1200 I let it go for 1200 girl came and looked at it um, she test drove it. She got a her stepfather works at a mechanic shop. We drove it over there. They put it on a computer, and checked it out. Everything was okay. Um, so I let them walk. They walked away with that today. Um, that was less than 48 hours. I was trying to flip that one in 24. I think I said, but I got it out in 48 in less than 48 hours. So it was it was I didn't meet my quota, but. I don't know. I'm gonna see what I can do with this one. This one might be a quick flipper. The Hondas are the Honda Civics are the number one selling Honda. Um, um, but I think Toyotas or something are the number one selling car. I'm not sure. But I mean, these are these things. These Civics are pretty usually sell pretty fast. I had a Honda. I had a Honda Accord. I just sold not long ago. I sold within. Um, 24 hours. I don't even think I listed it, but I sold that car pretty fast. So um, I don't know, but that's just the, the the lick on this car right here. Hopefully tomorrow I'm gonna get I'm gonna catch y'all up on what's going on with it. I'm probably gonna have to take a trip to the junkyard to grab a few of the little small things that it needs to keep it riding safe, and then I'm gonna clean it up and take y'all along with me. But um, until next time, man, um, don't forget to subscribe to my channel hit that notification button so you can get updated on all of the new videos that i put out on a daily basis i'm trying to get them out at least every day if not every day every other day so until next time i'll see you when i see you peace